Welcome back folks, we review tonight, well i a review, my kind of unboxing, so well, big thanks to Pomley, I'm going to review the Traveller wood stove, ultralight titanium wood stove, comes in at US dollars, 375 US dollars, so this is slightly different from previous stoves they've sent me. So as you can see, it comes in a nice thickened wear resistant storage bag. All the other Pomley stove have got a kind of flat pack, so this one's slightly different. But very nice bag. I know the very first one I got came in a it was more like a canvas bag. Next couple that I got, it was, I don't know, it was like a kind of more like a papery bag. I didn't really like the kind of paper bags, whereas this, this is definitely quality. So, let's open it up. Obviously it's got the two carry handles. It's also got these four straps for two either end. So that's quite handy, probably attach that to the back of a rucksack. At the front, it's just a Pomley logo, two zips. And then the piece of resistance is the traveller stove. So let's get out of the bag and get a look. This is that, that's the back, that's the front, obviously it's got the glass side, so really are good these stoves, very light, this one comes in at 1.5 kilograms, 3.3 pounds, and you can make it out, it's all riveted all the way around it, just show you what's inside, but we'll, we'll go through the kind of front part first. So obviously you just get the door at the front. Uh, I've got a kind of section of paper here, right? So obviously it's never going to rust or corrode because it's titanium. Uh, it's octagon, octagon, octagonal stove body, as you can see. Right, it's fireproof glass that's on the, the side of it. Right, and it does obviously give you internal light in your tent and obviously you can see the wood burning etc. Very nice bit of kit. Right, the titanium's at 0.6mm. It's got folding legs. Four of. Obviously it just sits nice and neat on the ground. Right, it's got an, an adjustable damper, which is probably inside. I'll show you what all comes with it. You obviously get the titanium flue. Right, and the trick with these, also I've got a few of these stoves, is you need to, first time you use it, you need to kind of burn it in, and what it does is it memorises the shape of the flue. Right, I've got it all unwrapped now. So that's the flue. Comes with one, two, three, four, and eight of the wee rings. So once you obviously roll it out. Also comes a wee set of heat proof gloves. Well, sorry, not heat proof gloves. I think that's more just to stop you cutting your fingers. You've just got to be very, very careful when you're rolling it out because obviously the edges are kind of reasonably sharp. But they come in quite handy, even if you're keeping your, your hands clean. Obviously, once you've used it a few times, it's covered in lots of soot and stuff like that. But obviously, that comes with it. That's the wee adjustable damper. So that basically slots onto the top. Right, you get the titanium spark arrestor. So 
again, great wee bit of kit. Put the slots on the top. Right, I'm not going to put this totally together just now, but I'll show you all the pieces that, that come with it. The damper, just the same as the others. I'll see on the, the top, there's just three screws. So there's what we do with them. and tighten them and then basically the damper just slots onto the top so you just line up the holes and then it's just a case of screwing the damper in and obviously there's three of these so you just tighten them all up and that's the damper in place very very neat bit of kit but it is different this one because obviously it doesn't flat pack oh there's a few wee differences actually now this is what I like about this, and this is obviously a new design. It's even got the raised plate at the bottom, right, and other ones I've got don't have that. So that's a that's a new part of the design, I like that, that's very very good. Right, obviously, the damper is adjustable. You've obviously got the grate at the front as well. One. It's obviously got the, the locking mechanism, which just basically slots down like that. It's also got the adjustable, oh sorry, the adjustable sliding air intake control. So that's at the front, nice and easy to work. Right, it's so obviously you can adjust the intensity of the burn by adjusting that, obviously adjusting the damper at the back. Right, it's got a two year, two year warranty with it, which is good. Uh, can't tell a lie, very impressed with it. I'm not joking, it really is. I mean, it weighs next to nothing. Leg wise, she's pretty sturdy as well. I mean, it does just hold up and down like that. So very very neat little stove, I really do like this one and the fact that it's slightly different and they've obviously every time they, they seem to design one of these they seem to design it that little bit, bit better the only difference with this one like I say is the fact that it doesn't, it doesn't fold, it doesn't flat pack but does that really matter? I think to be honest the weight that's in it and you can still just strap it to the back of your pack Especially with the, the lighter weight tents, so that's still to come. Uh, I'm going to do a couple of separate videos. I've got a couple of the Hussars, I think I've got the Hussar Plus and the kind of mini Hussar, which is the two lightweight tents. So that'll probably be a future video. But that's basically the traveller the traveler stove. So very nice. Right, and all that happens is, looks are finished with it. The thing about these, of course I'm just going to wrap it back up just now, but it all basically slots back in and fits inside the stove. So basically you can carry everything with you. So I'm going to unscrew it up again, slot it all back in the bag, and then that basically shows you what it, shows you what it looks like. Oh. But one thing I will do is I'm just going to get a couple of photographs with it. Just to just obviously find the thumbnail in front of the video. But hopefully that gives you an idea of the Pomeroy Traveller stove. Very nice indeed. I must admit, I really am impressed with that. So I'm looking forward to using that. Probably a bit warm just now. Uh, 
Honestly, it's absolutely roasting. It's been roasting the last couple of weeks. So I'll probably wait till the kind of colder weather comes in to actually test it out and do a burn in it. Obviously, there's no point in having a, getting the hot tent out just now because it's too hot. <laughs> Whereas come winter, this is when these things come into their element. Especially the hot tents, the wood burning stoves. I've got a few different types of these stoves, like I say, but very, very good the fact that they're so lightweight. I've also got a, a couple of kind of heavier stoves and they're like three, four, five times the weight of these things. So they're absolutely ideal if you're, I don't know, going to hike or going to trek into the, the forest or wherever you go camping. These are definitely, I would highly recommend them. Uh, so that's basically the Traveller stove. So. Hopefully that does give you a better idea of what it looks like, how it all goes together, different, part, different parts of the design to it, and the kind of differences between the previous kind of stoves that they do. The next, I have got another one coming, but it's a different one from this, so once that arrives, I'll show you that one as well, and then maybe what I'll do, I'll do a wee comparison video of them all, just to show you what they all look like next to each other. Right, and just give you an idea of the different types you can get, different sizes, etc. So folks, thanks for watching. We'll catch you in the next one. Adios.